now that kids are back in class, you can expect them bringing home not only homework, but plenty of germs. Mm -hmm. Ashley, standing by with how you can make sure your medicine cabinet is also back in school ready. Yes, it is true. I have Johnny Bowden here, the nutrition myth buster. Thanks so much for being here with us. My pleasure. So we're going to bust some of these myths, yes. right? Okay, so we're going to do, we're gonna, we're gonna do some, yes. some fun with it, right? Yeah. So we're going to do a little trivia game to learn exactly what these myths are, yes. and if it's true or not. Exactly. So okay. let's start with how many days do you think school kids miss in the United States on a yearly basis? On a yearly basis. For the common cold. How many missed days of school? 13. 13? 13. 22 million. 20, I'm sorry, wait. The whole country. Oh, the whole country. This should be individually. I'm like, that's not even possible. 22 million days missed for the common cold. Wow. So here's my hack for that. Okay. Black elderberries are one of the most potent antiviral Berries. They've got so many compounds in them that help do this. Okay. And this is the best black elderberry, elderberry, excuse me, elderberry, elderberry. extract. <laughs> and it's called Sambucal. Okay. And it is magical. This has been shown to actually decrease the number of days that you're out. Wow. It may not prevent the common cold. Nothing prevents the common cold, although okay. we take it in our house as a kind of preventive just in general because it's so powerful antioxidant, but it does cut the number of days that you're out. So I make this a part of every kid's daily okay. use. Okay. All right. In I'm ready for my next question because I'm trying question. to ace this because okay, I didn't do so well on this. Okay. What, what happens when your kids have digestive upsets, gas, bloating, and missed days because of that? What do you do? What do you mean? What do you give them? Oh. What's a like good cure for them? Tums? No. <laughs> what do you give a kid? No. I don't know. I don't you know. You got to give them more fiber in their diet. Oh, That's the okay. bottom line of that because <laughs> all of that stuff is related to digestive upset, gas, bloating, all the got things that it. they complain about. They don't want to go to the bathroom in school. All of that can be really helped by fiber. Got and it. I recommend fiber supplements. And if you think, how are you going to get your kids to eat anything with fiber? Yeah. Like this regular girl, which is my favorite one, and Sun Fiber, they're really the same one as branded. Okay. Women, but okay. Taste this. You're making me eat something now. I'm going to make you taste okay. the most delicious. Tell me that you're kid okay. or any kid would not eat this. Mm -hmm. That's good. It's not bad, right? Mm -hmm. It's like chocolate pudding. Mm -hmm. This is made with garbanzo beans and fiber. Oh. And dark cocoa and oh. a little bit of maple syrup. Okay, well, good so, thing the show's almost this over. This is huh? really, really great, right? Okay. okay. <laughs> honey, do you think honey can work for sore throats? Yeah, of course. It does. I have a sore throat right Absolutely now. Absolutely true. Yes. It's wonderful. It coats the. And then oatmeal. Okay. Uh, eczema, skin conditions. Oh, yeah. You think it might be useful for that? Okay, yes. Yes, but only a certain kind. It's called colloidal oatmeal. It's oatmeal that's been ground and then suspended in water. Okay. And when you use it, these are a couple of commercial ones you can get anywhere. It is great for your kid's skin. This is great. Okay, so wait, did we get through all of our questions? We got through all of our questions. Okay. We need to use Sambuco for the kids, for their common cold, okay. for all kinds of infections and things like that that they get in flu season. Yep. We need the oatmeal bats, honey for the sore throat, and regular girl or sun fiber. Every single day, you can put it in drinks, you can put it in coffee, and it's odorless and tasteless. And awesome. Johnny, see, Johnny, my man, thank you pudding. so much. Okay, here's the thing. I got two of the four right, 50%. I failed. That's cool. <laughs> awesome. All right, guys, stay with us. Okay. Don't leave home until 11.